Hello Super Set Maniacs and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of the series The Perfect Bodybuilding Physique Hybrid in which we're building the perfect bodybuilder using different body parts from different bodybuilders. We do this for each of the 8 mandatory poses and in today's episode we're gonna take care of the abs and thighs pose. If you have missed the previous episodes, you can find links to all these episodes in the description of this video, where you can also find a playlist for season 1 of this series, where we did the same thing, the difference being that those hybrids looked more unnatural and unrealistic in a way than these season 2 hybrids we're working on right now. That being said, remember to like this video if you appreciate my work and want me to continue what I'm doing. This is a great way to support the channel guys. Thank you so much. So today we're going to build the perfect abs and thighs pose in 5 different steps, meaning we're going to use 5 different body parts from 5 different individuals. So without further ado, let's get to step number 1 which is the head. In this season I'm going uh, to use uh, my own head for all the, the hybrids. This is my guilty pleasure for this series, so BOOM! Step number 2, chest and arms. This step also includes the lats, basically the silhouette of uh, this hybrid. There are lots of bodybuilders that had incredible tapers throughout the vast history of this sport, but I'm gonna choose a more recent guy that has an incredible shoulder to waist ratio, as well as world class arms and chest. His name is Brandon Curry. Boom. Step number 3, the abs. We have the perfect silhouette already, the perfect taper, but unfortunately, Brandon's abs are not defined enough to be in the conversation. There were countless bodybuilders with great ab development, however, I narrowed the list to a few, some more successful ones like Lee Priest, Sean Ray, Dexter Jackson or Sean Roden, and in the end I decided to go with Sean Ray. He's got a perfect six pack and some impressive uh, obliques as well. Boom. Step number four, the quads. The quads are very important in every front and side pose. Even in the back poses, uh, some great quad sweeps can make the difference. But they are most important in this pose, I believe. We have used several bodybuilders for the quads throughout uh, this series, like Tom Platts, Ronnie Coleman, Jay Cutler, Kai Green, Sean Roden or Big Ramy, but there is one more guy who had incredible leg development overall, Branch Warren. So he is my pick for the quads in this episode. Boom. Step number 5, the all important calves. Branch Warren had one of the most complete lower bodies in the history of the sport, so he's gonna get the calves as well in this episode. Boom! Mark Max Muscle posted a video a while back searching for the most complete lower body of all time and I believe Branch Warren came on top. I will leave a link to his video in the description if you guys are curious. So, what do you guys think about our perfect abs and thighs hybrid? Let me know in the comment section your opinion, like the video if you want to support the channel, also subscribe if you don't want to miss any of my videos and as always, thank you guys and see you next time.